At least two billion stars in our universe, somewhere in deep space there are probably planets with civilizations built by living creatures, some peaceful, some warlike. From the distant Sapphire Galaxy, a ferocious race of creatures have set out to conquer our universe, beginning with the planet Earth. A nuclear war is imminent, the results of which will poison even the distant reaches of outer space and planets such as this one, the Emerald Planet. Though they are fierce fighters when it comes to defending and protecting their way of life, the Emerald Men in the Marfet Galaxy are essentially creatures of peace. They realize, however, that the Siberians' mad idea of conquest now threaten their very existence, and drastic steps must be taken to prevent this dangerous act of aggression. The High Council of the Emerald Planet is now deciding what must be done. Finally, this great forum of the Emerald Hierarchy reaches a decision. In order to save Earth from the invasion of the Sephirians, they once more must present the globe meter to one of their fellow creatures, send him to Earth. He is the creature known as Starman. enough radioactive material to destroy Earth within a few seconds. He knows that even though he may be killed, he must attack the ship. discovery is made. Professor, in the telescope, the GP object lens has been smashed. What? The lens? Look. We won't be able to use it anymore. It's true. On an island 2,000 miles away in the Yamanaka Space Laboratory, where a spaceship to be used for peaceful purposes is being built, another discovery is made and reported to Dr. Yamanaka, who is at home.